Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a challenge that many developers encounter when working with HTTP servers. Our viewer is looking for a way to implement automatic custom authentication using Apache HTTP Client 4 Plus. The goal is to send authenticated requests while ensuring that authentication only occurs when necessary, such as when an auth token is missing or expired. All right, guys, we're back with another technical question. I'll be going through the question, the answer, and I'm hoping, just like me, you stay a little bit crazy to get that answer all the way through. Guys, let's get started. To implement automatic custom authentication with Apache HTTP client, we need to create a custom authentication scheme. This scheme will handle the authentication process based on the server's response. Next, we need to define an authentication strategy. This strategy will determine when authentication is required based on the HTTP response status code. Now, let's set up the HTTP client with our custom authentication strategy and credentials provider. This will allow us to send requests while managing authentication automatically. Finally, we can execute our requests. The client will automatically handle authentication when needed based on the server's response. In summary, by implementing a custom authentication scheme and strategy, we can ensure that our HTTP client only authenticates when necessary, improving efficiency and security. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. This implementation demonstrates a custom authentication scheme using Apache HTTP Client. It works well with version 4.2, but encounters an infinite loop with version 4.5. The MyAuth Scheme class handles authentication by sending a login request with user credentials in JSON format. It checks for a successful response and manages cookies automatically. The MyAuth Strategy class determines if authentication is needed based on the response status. It retrieves challenges and selects authentication options accordingly. In the app class, a URI is defined for login and the authentication scheme is registered. It demonstrates making authenticated requests to a resource endpoint. The example shows how to execute multiple requests without re-authenticating after the initial login, thanks to cookie management. And that's it, guys. I hope this video helped get you the answer that you're looking for. Now, I'll see you next time. Please subscribe for more question and answer videos. And if you have any more, please just shoot them through in the comments. Have a good one.